Book the Hawa, Book the Awashai, Book the Hawa, Book the Awashai, Call Halayim La Yahawa, Bashem, Yahushai, Bashem, Kakudash, Yahawa is the true, holy, powerful, and of the Heavenly Father, Yahawa. Yahushai is the true, holy, powerful, and of the only God's Son, Yahushai, which is our Lord and Savior. Let the Almost and Akabala has claimed, so as Allah was me get double honors to the elders of Israel, which is the apostles, the elders of Great Millstone, with these were real. Shalom, Wahala, Bakiya, so as Allah. Just mean peace and love to the lack of Israel. Come on to that lesson. Let's go be straight to the point. Really, uh, the name of this lesson is the true Israelites will receive the, the laws in the inner parts, you know? Because only the Israelites are under the covenant, man. That's who the, um, the most I'm dealing with is his people, man. The Lord ain't dealing with nobody else except his people, which is the nation of Israel, man. You know, this is what make up the nation of Israel right here, the 12 tribe of Israel, from Judah all the way down to Issachar. You know, the so-called Negroes, the Latinos, Hispanics, you know, and Native American Indians, you know. The 12 tribe of Israel, man, this is who the law was given to, man. And only we can go off, man, you know, because we are under the law to this day, man. You know, but you got these fake Israel Israelis, you know, these fake, <laughs> who call themselves Israelis, you know. The fake Jews sacrificing chickens, you know, to atone their sins, man. You know, hey, what that at in the scriptures, man? This also prove that they can't be the uh, the chosen people, man. They are sacrificing chicken, man. You know, the most I ain't dealing with that, man. Hey, when the Lord came down, Yahweh Shai, you know, who the England ignorantly called Jesus, you know, which is not his name. His true name is Yahweh Shai. When he came down. He sacrificed, man. He sacrificed himself, man. That's why he was crucified, man. You know? He shed his blood for the nation of Israel. You know, ultimately the elect, you know? But all nations, all Israel were going to be saved in the kingdom of heaven, you know? But let's get on getting to it, man. This first John 3 and 4. Whosoever committed sin transgressed also the law. For sin is the transgression of the law. And all Israelis... Hey, you not under the law, man. So you doing that in vain, man. You know? So it's a, uh, so in order for you to be on a uh, transgress the law, you know, you got to be under the law, man. And the scriptures say the wages of sin is death, man. And uh, that's why we die, you know? But in the kingdom of heaven, once the law, statute, commandments, being our inward parts, we not going to die anymore. That when immortality going to come, you know? So this uh Psalm seven eighty five for he established a testimony in Jacob, you know, and appointed a law in Israel, you know, Jacob's name was changed to Israel, you know. It said which he commanded our fathers that they should make them make them known to their children, man, you know. So the law, statutes, and commandments were only given to the nation of Israel, man. That's plain and simple, man. You know. Let me get this um gonna bring this out. This is a walk. 44 and 19, he said, Abraham was a great father of many people, and glory was there none like unto him, who kept the law of the Most High, and was in covenant with him, he established the covenant in his flesh. And when he was proved, he was found faithful. Therefore he assured him by earth that he would bless the nations in his seed, you know, and that he will multiply him as the dust of the earth, and exalt his seed, it's the stars and cause them to inherit from sea to sea and from the river unto the utmost part of the land. I think you can find this in the book of Genesis as well, you know. Verse 22. It said, With Isaac did he establish likewise for Abraham his father's sake the blessing of all men in the covenant and made it rest upon the head of Jacob, you know. That's who the covenant was given to, man. The law, statutes, and commandments were given to, man. Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, man. It's a chosen line, man. You know? It's, it's a, and made it rest upon the head of Jacob. And acknowledged him in his blessing and gave him a heritage. And divided his portions among the twelve tribes that he part them, man. You know? The twelve tribes, man. You know? Judah all the way down to Issachar, man. You know? This, this is who the, uh, the true Israelites are, man. And also, you got the uh, the elders of like foreigners, man. Because we've been uh, cursing, you know? You read Deuteronomy 28, I think 64 tell you that, man. 
the nation of Israel would be scattered among the nations, man. So some Israelites would look like the Chinese people. You know, some Israelites would look like so-called white people, man. You know, and so on, man. Look so-called like Ch Japanese people, you know, Arabs. You know, but if your line, your spirit goes back to an Israelite, you're an Israelite, man. You know, you better hope and pray, man. You know, so look up, get back in um, Psalms. So like Psalms 147, 19, he showed his word unto Jacob, his statutes and judgment unto Israel. He had not dealt so with any nation. It's for his judgment. Judgments, they have not known them. Praise you the Lord. Right, man. The other nations don't know the Lord, man. You know? Because they don't have the law of statutes and commandments, man. You read Amos 3 and 1 to tell you that. It said, you only have I known on all the families of the earth, you know? The, hey, the Lord only dealing with his people, man. That's why um, when the Lord come back, he going to start with his people. It said, judgment must begin at the house of Israel, you know, of the Most High, you know? Judgment going to come at us first, man, because we know better. We got the law of statutes and commandments, you know? In Jeremiah 31 and 31, Behold, the day is come, said the Lord, that I will make a new covenant with the house of Israel and with the house of Judah, you know? The house of Israel and with the house of Judah. You know, Israel, um, the uh, the northern tribe, you know, and Judah is the southern kingdom, man. You know, you can see Judah and Benjamin and Levi is the southern kingdom, you know. And Simeon, all the way down to Issachar, represents the northern kingdom, man. You know? It said, Not according to the covenant that I made with their fathers in the day that I took them by the hand to bring them out of, out of the land of Egypt, which my covenant they break. Although I was a husband to them, said the Lord. Right, we broke the law of statutes and commandments, man. You know, we broke the covenant, man. That's why we in this place where we at now, man. That's why we going through what we going through now, you know. The curses, man. The read doing the the 28th chapter, man. The Lord said us uh, life and death, man. You know. Said us uh, blessings and curses, man. You know. It said 33. But this should be the covenant that I will make with the house of Israel. You know. After those days, said the Lord, I will put my law in their inward parts and write it in their hearts. And will be that power and that should be my people, man. You know. It also lets you know the Lord ain't dealing with everybody, man. You know. The Lord ain't dealing with everybody, man. He's only dealing with his people. Only, but mainly the elect on this side, man. Because only the elect going to come back to him, man. You know? But it said he would put his laws in, his, in our inward parts, man. That's talking about in the kingdom of heaven, man. We're not going to go off anymore, man. We're not going to sin anymore in the kingdom of heaven. Why? Because we're going to have the law, statute, commandments in us, man. Just like how you wake up and breathe, you know, naturally. They're going to be the, how the law is going to be in the kingdom, man. You know, if you're Israelite, because the other nations, the other heathens, they're not going to have the law, statute, commandment. So they're going to go off. They're going to die, but not the nation of Israel, you know. 34, it says, and they should teach no more every man his neighbor and every man his brother saying, know the Lord. Right? We're not going teach to teach no more like that, man. Everybody going to know the Lord. Yeah, how about Shema Shai, man? It said, for they should all know me from the least of them. Or to the greatest of them. This also lets you know it's levels and you're gonna be levels in the kingdom, man. You know? You got the elect and one third, you know, and two thirds, you know, from the least unto the greatest. But all Israel is gonna be good in the kingdom, man. All Israel is gonna be rich, man. But it's gonna be level of fame, you know, level of riches, man. But the other heathens are gonna be in subjection on us, man. Yes, we're gonna have slaves in the kingdom of heaven, man. If you were Israelite, man, plain and simple, it says, For I will forgive the iniquity, and I will remember that saying no more. Uh, Hebrews 8 and 7, it says, For if the first covenant had been faultless, then should no place have been sought for the second. Right, man. We need we need the law, statutes, and commandments in our inward parts, man. Ain't you tired going off, man? Ain't you tired suffering the, uh, the curses, man? I know I am, man. You know, it said, uh, and, hey, in this Hebrews 8, just going back what Jeremiah 31 said, man. You know, Jeremiah 31, 31 said, man. You know, same thing, man. So we can get, um, get ready to close out and get one. Um, this real quick. Uh, let me see. 
the loop to it all. Let me see. I'm going to start at 30. It said, for I knew that they would not hear me because it is a stiff-necked people. And this, hey, and this talking about the nation of Israel, man. You know, you start up, you know. You just start up. But, hey, I'm just going to uh, read 30. It said, uh, Rook 23, for I knew they, they would not hear me because it is a stiff-necked people. But in the land of their captivities, they shall remember themselves. All right, we remember ourselves now. Ultimately, the elect, the 144,000, man. Cause we, hey, we still in captivity to this day, you know. We are still subject to payments, you know. You, if you say you not, uh, not a slave, you not a captivity, man. Hey, you, you lost, man. You still in darkness, man. Cause everybody got a drive license, they got a bus certificate, you know. They got a uh, security um number, you know. It's a um. Uh, so we remember ourselves, man. That we are the true Israelites, you know. 31, and it shall know that I am the Lord, that power, for I will give them heart and ears to hear. And they shall praise me in the land of that captivity and think upon my name. And then you know the name matter, man. You can't just call him in a name, man. You know? His name, man. You know, Proverbs 30 and 4. You know, what is his name and what is his son's name? And this is Yahweh Bashem Shah, man. You know? 33, and will turn from that stiff neck and from that wicked deeds. For they shall remember the way of their fathers with sin before the Lord. Right. 34. And I will bring them again into the land which I promised when the earth unto their fathers, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, man. Hey, the whole Bible is is, is for the Israelite, man. That That's who the Bible is for, man. For the nation of Israel. Ultimately, the elect, man. You know, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, man. You can't, you can't deny it, man. Cause people, hey, a lot of Christians want to go to John three sixteen, man. Hey, it's it's plenty of scriptures on that that talk about the nation of Israel, man. You know Isaiah forty five and seventeen. You know, it say Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, and they shall be lords of it, and I would increase them, and they should not be diminished, right, man? And in that land, you know, thirty four, talking about the the land of Israel, man, Jerusalem. You know, but don't fake Jews in that um in, in that land now, man. You know, they in that land now we're doing all type of abominations, man. That's why the Lord gonna uh gonna uh, hit that with fire too, man. You know, to clean it. Thirty five, and I will make an everlasting covenant with them, an everlasting covenant, man. You know, those who the covenant for, you know, the nation of Israel. It's saying I will make an everlasting covenant with them to be their power, and that should be my people. I will, and I will no more drive my people of Israel. Out of the land that I have given them, man. And that's what's going to happen in the kingdom of heaven, man. In the kingdom of heaven, we're going to be good, you know. We're not going to go off anymore, man. And that's a beautiful thing, man. Ain't you tired of dying, man? You know? So with that, I hope you are edifying. Once again, I'm going to give our praises and glory to Yahweh, by Shem, Yahweh Shot, by Shem, Conquer Dust. Want to give double honors to the apostles and his great millstone to Israel. And I want to say peace and love to the elect of Israel. With that, Shalom, Quran Allah.